and um, I'm going to start up a new series. Actually, I'm going to be starting up two new series of um, Aquarius Skies. One I will be doing offline, like I am right now, and another one that I will be doing with Zyzix on a server that I set up for us. So um, I don't know when those episodes will be coming out, probably not t anytime soon. By the time you watch this video, I'm probably going to be underway. Um, I do have some videos already scheduled to air during the time I'm gone. Alright, well let's begin. I should have completely restarted and hopefully I don't fall into a void. No void. No void. No void. No void. No void. No void. Um, for those who are not familiar with uh, Aguarius Skies, it is a mod pack on Feed the Beast and this is not the... it did not reset. This is not a reset. This is not good. Why did I do this? Let's see if there's another map. Single player. Um, shoot. Let's try this one, T. Here we go. <laughs> Let's start off fresh. I have played the Guardian Skies before. But like I said, those who are unfamiliar with it, it is a hardcore kind of skyblock game. And that was my um, Facebook. Huh. Sorry about that. Um, I, my Facebook's been pretty active. I just came out and let everyone know that I am a crossdresser. So... Um, not many people have been upset. I think only one person doesn't understand, but like I said, man, everyone should be themselves and not let anyone else tell them otherwise. <laughs> All right, to start this off, I'm going to get some wood. All right, got a tree. Actually, I should have started off with the book. It has been a horrible... I'm going to skip the story. I already know this. Uh, the book gives you general information. I have two lives currently. I can get more. I do not have a party going on. I can make one. Uh, like right here, let's make it Team LB Network. Great party. There we go. I'm the owner, and if other people join this game, which no one will, it's a solo game. I can have them in here. Whoops. Um, this tells me what I can do. Um, right now it just says, hey, get one oak plank, and then you can complete this quest. So that's what we're going to do. Alright, so since I don't have much, I have to actually hit the wood with my hand. Take the wood place in here and it will automatically detect it and I can claim my reward a pickaxe and an apple and then other stuff comes up now it's gonna teach me a little bit more on the game um, about manual submitting so I have to manual submit claim my reward it took one of my woods away now I got this box place the box down now it's going to say, using the box, I have to queue this quest, select the task, right click this, the box is selected, grab this hopper they so graciously gave me, and then place the wood in there, it gets sucked into there, and the quest is complete. And now it wants the hopper back, so I actually have to give the hopper back because it'd be a little OP me having this early in the game. So we're going to manual submit the hopper, we'll take the claim. I got a heart for that. Eat the heart, I now have three lives. Reward bags. They can be good, they can be bad. I got a black swallowtail. Not that good of a reward. Oh well, we'll just throw that in there. And we will look at what we need to do now. Oh, we gotta start making um, the items listed before. Most of this is from Teacher's Construct. Which means I'm gonna need wood. Which actually, shoot, I can't do it without a crafting table. Let's uh, let's get a crafting table going first, because we're gonna speed up a little things. <laughs> so easy enough, crafting table, bam! If you want to get the Tinker's Construct crafting table or crafting station, you just put the crafting table in again, and then you got that. Nice thing about this is if I exit out, the items stay in. Really nice. But we're going to make a crook, which is just four sticks, and now we get a crook. 
The reason why I want to make them crook, um, you get a better chance of saplings or uh, worms dropping when you hit leaves with it. Which we need the worms for a later quest, which, yay, I just got a sapling. We need the worms for a later quest, so we can get silk. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I only got one sapling. That's sad. Alright, let's get the rest of this wood. But sometimes this happens. Um, I only got one sapling, I only got one sapling. If I lose this sapling, I'm kind of in pain. And I'm going to have to use the other saplings until I can start sitting dirt to get more saplings. But, like I said, got another sapling there. Wish it's raining. Now, hunger is a big issue on this game. Which, what do I got the game set as right now? Usually I have it on peaceful to begin with, which I'm going to do that. I still get hunger in, um, in this game. The reason why I want to have it in peaceful is it gets really annoying trying to deal with mobs randomly. Um, because this island is not all lit up to begin with, so mobs can spawn pretty easily, especially on the roof of the house. So, um, best thing to do is make sure you got a torches on the roof whenever you're able to do that. Alright, so now, let's keep at least, whoop, I need at least one of those. Turn them all into planks. Let's make some paper, two pieces of paper. Place this here, place this here. Got a parts bench. Um, place that there, place this here, sketch table, and I think I need one more piece of paper. I kind of, and a crafting table, tool station, alright. Tool station you want right next to this because then it will give you the ability to repair your tools um, through the crafting table. Let me get rid of this. Come on. Go away. I want you going too because I'm going to put the uh, parts builder right there. And then we're going to put the sketch table right there. Alright, that's done. Let's um, go ahead and make a chest. Place the chest on top of it and then you'll have access to the chest there. Alright, let's do one more tree, so we can get this quest done. And you did not just do that. Why? I hate these trees. Especially with me not having food yet. I mean, I have some apples, but it's best to turn the apples into uh, apple juice, which you need a juicer for that, and I'd have to have stone. Which, in a later episode, you'll figure out how to get... I will, um... Let you guys know how to get some, sorry. This is annoying. Alright, I'm back. I'm sorry about that. I fell down the tree, which, um, while using the crook, I ended up getting a silkworm, which I'm going to need later. But right now, we are going to make barrels, and I'm going to make a lot of them. Which, put that back. Oh. Come on. There we go. Don't do any of that. Six barrels, which we're going to put three in here and three outside. So we can start collecting water. Now a nice thing with a barrel inside, you can right click, it costs eight of them, and you can start composting saplings into dirt. Alright, now with that being done, we should have this quest done. Um, I'm taking the axe. I'm not too fan of the, the pan, so there we go. Oh, and look at that. We already got the quest for the silk stuff. Now, see, this is going to take some time, and I'm probably going to have to edit this out of the video again from this point on, but let's first of all see what's in the reward bag. Ooh, a sound muffler. That's actually decent. It didn't say it wasn't that good. Um, another good item is this rain muffler, which you can just put up here. 
and then you won't hear the rain. But a sound muffler, like if you have a mob spawner and you don't want to hear the mobs, it's really good to have. So, yet again, let's uh, go into this. And we'll grow the tree, we'll take the silkworm, and we'll place it in the tree. And then it's waiting. Lots and lots of waiting. But I really don't want to um, put you guys through that. So I'm not going to. And give me that sapling. Do I get it? No. Give me a second, I want that sapling. Gotcha. Whoa. Dang it. Wish there was a way I could get up farther. That would be nice. All right, so um, I'm going to uh, stop the video here, and um, I'll be back after the uh, tree is ready to harvest. All right, bye YouTube. Go. Well, I'm back. Um, I'm sorry, just finishing up getting some wood here. Uh, but the silk tree is done, which I am going to have to get another one. But I will be extending my island. I did do change little things while I was waiting for the silk tree to be complete. Come on. Sorry, this is... Alright, boom. Plant. I did put some stairs because jumping's kind of bad at classes you need to eat. Which I probably shouldn't eat because I don't like being... Then we put this here, and we'll fill this up, and let's get on to the silk. Yet again, it's just best to hit it with the crook. That's why <laughs> I kind of made four crooks, but I added that out, you didn't see that. Which, I think I'm down to my last one now, yep. I'm just hoping this gives me enough silk so I can complete the next challenge. And hopefully I get another bug. Which might as well grab this wood and get another tree planted and if I had the bug I'll throw it on there. Yes, I know downtown. All right, let's finish this. Okay, there we go. And I have six bugs. Good. So I'm going to put one here, one here, one here, and one there. Speed up the process. All right, um, how much silk? I got 27 silk. Hopefully this is enough. First of all, let's get two of these. Wood. So I think it's two woods, two sticks, and this. Yep, to make the uh, oak sieve. We'll just put you right there. Uh, what else did I need to make? I think I need to make a bed. Oh, uh, Facebook again. <laughs> a hammer and a bed and a fishing pole. Let's make the. Uh, don't think I have enough for the bed. Nope, I don't, sadly, but we, could, we do have enough for the fishing pole, so. Grab some six. Was it like this? No, it wasn't like that, it was three six. There we go, fishing pole. And I guess we'll make the hammer now, too. And then, boom, got a hammer. Um. Well, I guess while we're waiting for that, um, we can start extending the island a bit. Uh, which we need these. Which I would like to extend the island so I can start planting more trees. Now this is where it gets a little bit annoying. Because I don't want to fall. If I fall, I die. <laughs> And that's not good. Alright, 
let's see. Um, that should be far enough away. Two. Oops, that was the map. <laughs> Haven't expected anything much. Uh, there, there. Leave the other one open. Three, one. And we want to extend this out. I'm going to extend this out by one more. I want at least three across. Oh! There's one thing I am going to do. I know probably not many people do this, but game rule, mob, griefing, false. Especially after I'm most likely going to be making my um, mob spawner out of um, cobblestone. And with the creepers in there, it's just going to make it a real, real headache trying to work with. And you can see it's pro uh, there's some progress to the tree. And one more. Oops. I'm going to lose both those pieces because that's a half slab down. Hopefully I don't lose them. Oh, I didn't lose them. Sweet. And, I mean, it will get a lot more interesting once we start, um, which... Yeah, uh, making the uh, automatic tools, uh, the ones that will auto mine, auto cut my trees. Um, there's a lot that they put into this uh, game and how it all works together is brilliant. All right, grab the extra dirt that I made. Let's go plant this. We'll put these right here. And let's get you big and tall. Big and tall. All right, let's see if I can um, crook some of this string off so we can make the bed. too soon. You gotta make sure they're white. And, oh, I have enough to make, oops, a little bit too much now, the bed. Boom. Wish uh, um, anyone who plays Minecraft should know how to make a bed. <laughs> And take a nap. Let it let it become day. <laughs> All right, that is done. Um, let's see. What do I want? I think I'm gonna grab carrot seeds. Oh, whoops! I have to make my first stone. Shoot. All right. Well, I'm gonna take down this tree since I do now have what I need. So, come on. Goodbye, tree. Dig this up, and you'll find a dirt chest with an extra seven dirt. Little Easter egg they have there. Don't let them know I let you know. How much was that? Oh, four. Perfect. Um, if you sieve, you have a chance of getting uh, uh, little pieces of stone, which combine into a stone brick. And now I can claim my carrot seeds. Now, this quest, which we have to change this cobblestone into gravel, from dirt, gravel to dirt, from dirt to... Uh, no, not dirt, sorry. Uh, gravel to sand, um, cobble to gravel. <laughs> Gravel to sand and sand to dust. And then when, if you put the dust in water, 
which you get clay, which I need clay. <laughs> so that should have completed that portion of the quest. I'm not trying to go to bed. Um, I like the quest war beds. I don't really get the hearts. And I think we're, we have a little bit too much stuff. Let's put these hearts in here. Sound muffler, the carrot seeds, the dirt I'll keep. Put that there, and let's, oh, wow, I got a heart. <laughs> well, that didn't help too much. Um, I'm going to sieve the rest of this dirt because I'm actually going to need the cobblestone so I can make a furnace. And um, the clay, I'm going to turn into a cauldron. All right, what did I get? Oh, I got a rubber tree seed. Oh, that is lucky. Oh, perfect. Six cobblestone. That's exactly what I needed, too. All right, um, this is going to be a different type of furnace because you only need to use slabs for it. And I'll just put it right there. And we will grab the wood. All right, that's taken care of. That is great. Um, let's take the sand, turn it into dust as well. Alright, now I got a good source of clay. Turn it into this. We're going to make ourselves a clay bucket, which you have to cook later. And then we'll take the rest of it, which we need seven, to make a crucible on fire, which I think is also. A quest. Let's uh, do this one. <laughs> Get a lot of hearts. <laughs> Open this up, and uh, wow, I'm just not getting anything good. <laughs> All right. Um, I should. There we go. Fire this up, and actually, I'm gonna need one of those. Put this here, give me some torches, oops. Now it's best to do this with lava, but unfortunately I don't have lava right now. So we're going to have to do it with just the torch. Place that there. And we'll just throw the gravel in. But now I have the capability of getting water. Which is very nice since I can do that. Um, the reason why I put this in here is this will make, turn the gravel into lava. It's cobblestone and gravel you put in here. Um, you, it's four to one bucket, so I actually am going to have to get more. But I think this was going to end the episode. If you enjoyed the episode, please hit that like button. If there's other stuff that you would like to see, please comment below. And subscribe if you haven't. Goodbye, YouTube.